Volcanologists on Thursday said they discovered a lava tsunami rapidly flowing from the Cumbre Vieja volcano on the Spanish island of La Palma. Cumbre Vieja started erupting nearly a month ago, forcing the evacuation of thousands of people as lava has made its way through towns and toward the Atlantic Ocean. Experts have described the latest volcanic activity on La Palma as a tsunami of lava. Huge rivers of molten rock have been spewing from the crater in recent days after a 4.5 magnitude earthquake shook the island on Thursday and intensified flows. The quake is the strongest recorded since the Cumbre Vieja volcano. On the island of La Palma in the Spanish Canary Islands, began erupting almost a month ago. Today one of our crew was able to film a truly lava tsunami. Amazing speed and overflow of the lava channel, said the Canary Islands Volcanology Institute, publishing the footage, which is included below. The government of the Canary Islands has said that this is the most damaging volcano in Europe in the last 100 years. Canary Islands President Ángel Víctor Torres said Thursday that while there is sorrow, sadness and uncertainty on the island, there is also hope and courage. As of Thursday, the lava has spread to 674 hectares, more than 1,665 acres, according to the European Commission's Emergency Response Coordination Center. Since the eruption started on September 19, 6,800 people have been evacuated, and 1,548 buildings have been destroyed. Ideo's lava with layers of black rocks surrounding a steaming orange and red core, slowly moving down neighborhoods, covering streets and swallowing objects that are in its path. The island's agriculture, a main source of income for people on the island, has taken a hit from the eruption. On Thursday, the government said that more than 179 hectares, about 442 acres, of crops have been destroyed. Impacted crops include banana trees, vineyards and avocados, among other crops, the government said. Along with the lava's path, a major concern for locals is the accumulation of ash. The government said Friday that it has distributed more than 22,000 pairs of goggles and 280,000 masks to areas that have been directly impacted by the eruption. Citizens have been urged to stay indoors, and if they go outdoors, to fully cover their skin. <laughs>